Congresswoman Slotkin isn't the only Senate candidate holding a party tonight. So is Republican Mike Rogers in Lake Orion. They are celebrating there. And that's where we find News 8's Megan Bunchman. She has more from the Rogers camp tonight. Megan. <laughs> Well, good evening. We are with now the Republican nominee for the U.S. Senate seat, Mike Rogers. Mike, we know that the Senate seat has not been held by a Republican for 30 years now. What are you going to do to take that seat back? Well, first of all, University of Michigan won a championship after 30 years. The Lions <laughs> won their division. This is the year we take back this seat for the people of Michigan. This is different in so many ways. The issues that are plaguing Michigan citizens uh, all are lining up for the things that we've been talking about with our solutions. The cost of groceries, the cost of gasoline, the cost of rent. Uh, the, the very fact that we have an open border that's having crime show up in these neighborhoods in southeast Michigan. We even had a murder, obviously, in Kent County with Ruby Garcia. Those things have got to change. People know something's broken. We have the solutions for these things, uh, and we're going to have the every working family in Michigan. They haven't had that in 30 years either. You said 91 days. That's the sprint now that you guys are looking forward to. Again, polls are showing that you are pulling behind the Democratic nominee. But you also added that you guys haven't spent a single dollar yet. So now's the time, correct? Now's the time. So we've been focusing on bringing the Republican Party together across the state. I think by our very strong showing tonight, we show we can do that. And now is a time for this was a family fight. So this is a time now for the family to come together and go after the other team and make sure, again, people can afford their groceries. We're going to make groceries affordable again. We're going to make sure that people feel safe in their neighborhoods. We're going to close and fix that border. And we're going to make sure that you don't get forced by the government to drive a car you don't want to drive. Final question. You've heard it a couple times now. Democrats are calling the Republican parties weird. You're a weird party, according to them. That's what they're saying. What are your thoughts? You, you, you know what's weird? The fact that we would like to be able to afford gasoline and groceries, and we don't want our jobs going to China. If that's weird, sign me up. You're obviously very well experienced. Best of luck. We've got two now people. We've got Mike Rogers with the Republican nominee, and then, of course, we've got Lisa Slotkin on the Democratic side. The race in November is on 91 days until the next vote. Right now, I'm making live, making punishment live in Lake Orion Township. I'm going to send it back to you guys. Yeah, Republicans believe this seat is in play. We will see in November. Thank you, Megan.